with some relief from the heat in sight there. The West Michigan Whitecaps ground crew has been busy keeping that field in top shape. News Ace Kyle Mitchell is live with how they've been dealing with the warm, humid weather. Kyle? Soon, Brian, the Whitecaps continue the series tonight against the Dayton Dragons. But to get this field ready, it takes a lot of work over some hot days. Long before the fans filled the seats at LMCU Ballpark, Mitchell Hooten and his team are working to make sure the field is ready for the game. It's been a long 12 games and 13 days. Um, today's kind of a reprieve. The, the finish line's in sight. Keeping the field green is no easy task, but the team hand waters and the humidity has helped keep the ballpark in top shape. If you look, it's really green compared to last week when we were starting to brown out a little bit. Keeping the dark green with a crisscross pattern requires around the clock attention. The crew is constantly monitoring if they need to tarp the field from a pop-up rain shower. Just really have to start watching how much water we put down, the time of the day we put it down. Um, I'm constantly checking you know, the weather apps of humidity and dew points. Maintaining the field doesn't take a break even during a heat advisory. We've been trying to do a lot more work at night when it's cooler temperatures out. Um, in the mornings, we're trying to limit as much time outside as possible. Um, more hand watering, but a lot of it just get our task done in the morning and try to get in the shelter and drinking lots of water. With a few precautions, Hooten says the heat isn't so bad. I personally love the heat. Um, I went to Mississippi State University, and I spent about 10 years down south, so the hotter hotter it is, the better it is for me. So I'm not a real big snow and cold kind of person, so this doesn't bother me that much. The compliments the ground crews get and seeing fans enjoy the game makes it all worth it. The hard work that the, the guys are putting in um, doesn't go unnoticed, so it's, it's really appreciative. And when the field is ready, the crew will take a break and be ready to get back out there. Being a little bit more efficient and getting things done a little bit quicker and then so we can get back in back in the shade and we're back in the AC. The game starts just after 6 30 tonight live in Comstock Park. Kyle Mitchell, News 8.